Gamer Braves. Hey guys, this is Sean from Gamer Braves. Today, we are going to talk about Hearthstone Adventure Mode. In the past, Blizzard introduced a lot of interesting adventures such as the Witchwood, the Boomsday Project, and Rastakhan's Rumble. With Rise of Shadow being the new expansion, surely there will be a new adventure, right? A couple of weeks ago, we are really fortunate to be able to try out Hearthstone's new adventure, which is being named as the Dalaran Heist. In Rise of Shadows, we get acquainted with League of Evil, which is an evil group formed by Arkfil and Rafam, and four other members, Togwaggle, Hagatha, Madame Lazul, and Blastmaster Boom. Their very first act of evil is to steal something from Dalaran. The adventure will bring players into the city of Dalaran, which we will get to know more about League of Evil. Gameplay-wise, it is very similar to a dungeon run, and Blizzard claims that this is the biggest single-player adventure in Hearthstone. There will be 9 new playable characters and each of them are a minion or an underling of members of League of Evil. There will be 5 chapters in total. Each chapter lets players explore different parts of Dalaran. Different parts of Dalaran will have a twist, such as Dalaran Bank will have a coin filled coffers, which every enemy will spawn a catch of cash. The first chapter and first hero, Rakanishu the Mage, is free. However, subsequent chapters will need to be purchased, and each chapter will unlock two heroes. Unlock heroes can be used at other chapters as well. The more bosses you defeat, the more runs you clear, the more hero powers you will unlock. In total, there will be three hero powers for each hero, and each hero will have four preset decks for players to pick. Every time you defeat a boss, you get to pick a loot, which will add additional cards to your deck. There will be 75 bosses in total, and each of them will bring their unique deck to stop your heist. Occasionally, while we are scouring through Dalaran for treasures, we might walk into tavern for drinks, and our friendly bartenders will let us somewhat modify our decks. We can remove specific minions, or add enemy minions into our decks, or even increase our very own hero health pool. Have you heard about this After unlocking all the chapters, players will also get to unlock Anomaly Mode, which grants a random effect for the run. This will give each run a very different and unique experience. Players could build a deck that could take advantage of the effect. A new card, Zale, Clock of Shadow, will be introduced to the game. It works similar like Wizbang. You'll play one out of five decks, which each of them will represent a member from League of Evil. If you'd like to know more about the new adventure, please check out our website link below at the video description. And that's all for today. If you liked the video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Hey guys, if you like our content, do like and follow our page. Also, select C first to get the latest game news and updates. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and select on the notify button to get notified to our latest gameplay trailers. Don't miss out!